So I figured since I've been making a lot of my videos in my office, maybe I'd change it up and come outside, shoot a video on my porch, get some fresh air. It feels great out here, it's a beautiful day, so here we are. What's up guys, Tristan here and I'm back with another video and today I got something really special for you guys. We'll get to that here in a sec. Um, a lot of my friends and a lot of people I know have been coming to me a lot lately because they wanna start creating their own content, start making their own videos, but there's always something standing in their way, whether it be equipment or ideas or the number one thing, talking to a camera. So what I tell them when it comes to that is to take a look at my very first video and compare it to my latest video. Why? Because I want them to see the growth. My first video to me is horrible. It's cringeworthy. I had zero camera presence. You could tell that I was really, really nervous. So I kind of held back a little, but over the years I've gotten more and more comfortable in front of a camera. The thing is you can't get better until you start. You can't improve until you shoot and upload your first video. There's no progress, but if you do it over and over again, the more you do it, the more used to it you'll be and the greater you will become. For me, talking into a camera has always been a struggle. It's always been a challenge for me, but since I've been doing it for so long, I'm used to myself like screwing up every now and then. I'm used to stuttering and I just became more comfortable. I became more patient and I get less frustrated when I mess up because I just do it until I'm done with the video. The thing is, I can have a conversation with anyone any day of the week, but there's something about that red dot, that red record dot. It's just different talking to someone that doesn't exactly talk back to you. My wife is going through this right now. She actually talks about this in her latest video that's linked down in the description below. So check this out. Uh, this is my second time doing this. Um, last year in April, I put together an entire video of my screw ups, all my mess ups, all my bloopers, just to show people the reality of making a YouTube video. And I'm also doing this for the people who, again, are stopping themselves from making content because they're scared to talk to a camera. I mess up too, it's okay. So with all that said, here we go. Action! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, long time. Ah, shit. There is a reason for that, and we're gonna get that. Honestly, I, wait, let's see. Honestly, when I first started uploading these videos, I had no idea where these videos would take. Wait. Obviously, when I upload, obviously, okay. Honestly, I had no idea where upload. It's been a great adventure these past three years, and for those of you who've been lifting, for the last couple of months, a lot of people have asked. For the last couple of months, a lot of people have been asking me, "What helmet do I wear when I'm riding?" For the. Got this. Okay. For the last couple of months, a lot of people have been asking me, "What helmet do I ride?" I don't ride a helmet. The. I've been walking. We walk. We rock. We rock. I've been rocking these helmets for a couple of years now, no, a year now. I've been rocking these helmets for about a year now and they can be seen in a bunch of my videos. A bunch, a bunch. I went to the University of West Georgia and I graduated in 2012, two years. It took me, a, it took me about two years longer to get out. Um, didn't like that, but I didn't know too many people. I didn't know a lot. Wait. So I get out to LA and wait. We have moved to Anaheim, and then from Anaheim we live, we... So by this time, so by this time I... That's something that, and that's something that can be very frustrating as a young person, not knowing what to do. And that can be something really frustrating for a person our... Wait. So not only did YouTube pretty much... So not only has, so not only did YouTube give me... Wait. So not only making... So not only did making YouTube channel... Wait. What's up guys, Tristan here, and I am back with another video here in Quarantine Central and wait, no. What's up guys, Tristan? What's up guys, Tristan here, and I am back with another video and today wait, What's up guys, Tristan? What's up guys, Tristan here, and I am back with another video. This by no means is like an in-depth tutorial or review on these apps. Just my light reason of why I like to poop on my pants. With all that said, we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it. And the first app we're gonna to talk today is the Moment app. Now, we're gonna go ahead and dive right into this. We're, so if you're familiar with my channel, you know by now that I am a huge fan of Moment. But if you, so if you watch my videos, you know I am a, 
Like, if you watch my videos, you know about Moment. They're one of my favorite companies out there. They are a mobile lens uh, company based in the city. So if you watch my videos, you know that I'm a huge fan of Moment. But for those who are new around here, your first time, wait. So if you guys watch my video, so if you guys have, wait. Moment is basically a mobile lens film. Wait. Moment is a mobile film company based. So just be really considerate about that. So I'm um, gonna go ahead and back to the office. Now. So as you guys can see, we are in. So as you guys can see, we are in true. We the word that has been thrown around a lot lately is this. So a lot. Okay. So the reason that so so the reason that social the reason that social distance the reason that social social distancing the important thing to remember is that the people who are at risk most wait, the important thing is to remember the people who are, are mostly the, the important thing is the important thing to remember that the people who are at most the important thing to remember here is that the people that are most compromised we wanted a direct access garage, mainly because when we park, it's just kind of nice to be able to park your car in here. Nope. Mainly so when we park our cars in here, we can just go straight up. So, uh. Action! Action! Welcome to our garage. This is uh, the third level of, no, this is the first level. <laughs> oh my god, that's great. Headshot. Uh, we want to take all these doors off, these cabinet doors, and eventually paint them. I've been under the belief where, I've been under the belief, no, I've been on top of that Under this housing, Shelter in place, shelter in place, shelter in place in quarantine, shelter in place in quarantine, all right. But you know, under this whole, in, in this whole. Today is April 25th, 2020, and it's been about six weeks. Wait. Today is April 25th, 2020, and it's been almost six weeks. Weeks. Yeah. Today is April 25th, uh, 2020, and it's been a, almost, wait. Well, there you have it. Those are all my screw ups from my most recent videos. Again, I've been doing this for three years and it's something that I struggle with to this day. But trust me, it's fine. All you have to do is just say what you need to say, do it as many times as you can until you got it, and all that can be edited in post. People don't have to see your screw ups and if they watch the video, they wouldn't think twice about it. They would think that you're a pro. And I think I just blew my cover with that. Guys, I'm not a pro. So I can't stress it enough whether you're that one person who's letting talking to a camera stop you from creating content or you're that person who's creating content but getting super frustrated talking to a camera, it's fine. I go through it too. You're not alone. Some people get better at it, some people don't. I'm one of the people who don't, and I'm fine with it. And with that said, that is the end of this video. So if you like this video, go ahead and smash that like button and subscribe to my channel. I upload videos weekly, follow me on social media, and if you haven't yet created a video, please, if you create one anytime soon, drop it in the comments. I will watch your video and give you positive feedback. And I'm out. My name is Tristan Irvin. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Hey, what's up with you? I'm shooting that video, cuz. Hey, that's my wife down there. She walking the dog right now. What up, girl? <laughs>